I'm going to go up and give a speech. <laughs> Good morning, London. How's everybody this morning? Can our veterans on the bus hear me? There you go. Folks, it is a great day to be here in London. Distinguished guests, honoraries, commanding officer, regimental sergeant major, all ranks, veterans of the regiment. I'm raising my voice so you can hear me. <laughs> Families and friends of the regiment, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for attending this historic parade. 150 years of service. 78 years since that tank. Hundreds of others. Tens of thousands of Canadian soldiers aboard those ships, ready for an uncertain future on D-Day. Today as we rededicate the Holy Roller and we remember all of those who served in the First Hazard, it is truly, truly humbling. Ladies and gentlemen, we are blessed to be Canadian. Absolutely blessed. Yeah, I know life's not perfect. Nothing's perfect. But oh my gosh, aren't we lucky? Aren't we fortunate to live in a beautiful country? This fantastic community of London. And let me just say right now that all of you out here today paying tribute to these troops, to those who made the ultimate sacrifice, is another testament to this great community. We as a nation are so lucky that we can live our values, freedom and democracy. Yet our freedoms have had to be defended and secured by those Canadians who placed service before self. And to hear those names, to know they're the sons and daughters of Canadians who left this community to achieve something greater than themselves. Uncertain of a future, but knowing they needed to protect their families. To the soldiers on parade today in those very smart patrol uniforms. And I know how uncomfortable those callers are. But you look sharp today. Absolutely. Demonstrating the outstanding professionalism and discipline of the Canadian Armed Forces and the heritage of this exceptional, proud, and courageous regiment. I want to thank each and every one of you for volunteering to serve so that Canada would be safe and secure. I want to thank the band for doing an outstanding job using your talent, giving us the energy, the drive for this outstanding parade. Let's give the band a Warm, warm appreciation. I want to thank the MC and especially the chaplain. The chaplain is holding those rain clouds at bay <laughs> and creating these outstanding conditions here. Chaplain, thanks for what you do, MC. Great job. Absolutely. I want to thank all of the veterans who made the effort to be out here today on parade, aboard the bus, those in the crowd, and I see many of you in the crowd. 
thank you for your dedication during your watch. Your leadership, your resilience, your professionalism. These soldiers on parade are looking at what right looks like. You train them. They are following in your footsteps. You are rightfully proud, and we thank you for all that you have achieved. God bless the veterans of the First Hazar. The Holy Roller Tank, refreshed and renewed, is a powerful symbol of the service, the sacrifice, and the resilience of all of the soldiers from London and this community who have served in this regiment over 150 years. When you look closely at the Holy Roller and you see the scars of combat, the fact that this tank, amongst those 345 other tanks that went into combat with this regiment, and you know that this tank faced evil. It faced adversity and it succeeded. It protected its soldiers and it brought them home safe and sound. And to see that this tank is out here today, refurbished and renewed, is absolutely amazing. A heartfelt thanks to everybody who contributed, who volunteered, who supported, worked thousands of hours to bring this tank back to its pristine condition. We owe them a round of applause. Let's do that right now. I'm nearly finished, folks. I still remember a parade when my son was on parade, and I said, hey, son, what do you think the troops want to hear? He said, Dad, they don't really care. Just get it summed up quick and get off parade. <laughs> But I want to thank the families. I want to thank the families of all of those who have served in, those, in this regiment, all of those who have served in the Canaan Armed Force. We can only serve the love and the care and the support of our families, who make so many sacrifices so that we may serve. Our families are the wind beneath our wings. And we owe a debt of gratitude for all of our families for what they have done for us. Let's give a round of applause for our families. And finally, folks, there are many ways to serve Canada. Some folks put on a uniform and serve in the military. Some folks become first responders. Some folks work in our medical system. Some folks lead our civil society in public office. Some folks volunteer in our communities to make Canada stronger. All of you make a difference, make Canada stronger and prepare us for an uncertain future. The troops on parade, great job. The regiment's motto in Latin is ho die non crom. I get that right, RSM? Yes, sir. <laughs> and what that means is today, not tomorrow. This regiment never procrastinates. This regiment gets things done. Ladies and gentlemen, God bless the first is ours. Today, and for the next 150 years and beyond, God bless this great community, and God bless Canada. Thanks very much.